Good evening, teacher. Hello. Good evening, class. Good evening, teacher. Hi, welcome to our final lesson. Are you ready for your final lesson? We are finishing the module. Woo -hoo -hoo. Congratulations. We are graduating today from basic two. Are you happy? Or you're not happy? Yes. Are you learning more English? Do you feel better now? Do you have more information now, huh? 
Welcome, everyone. Welcome. Yes. Thank you for coming early. We are early today because yesterday we had some problems, you know, with the connection. Remember? So that is why today we will start early. So how are you? I'm Oh yeah? Are you nervous? Are you happy? Are you anxious? Are you nervous? nervous. What are you feeling today? I'm happy. <laughs> happy? As usual. Happy, huh? Happy. <laughs> All right, all right, me too. I'm very happy to see you. Y accidentalmente aquí um, cerré la ventana que ya tenía lista. <laughs> all right. Anyways, welcome, guys. I'm so happy to see you today. It's the last day of classes. It's our last day of classes. I'm getting nostalgic. I'm getting homesick because I'm going to miss you tomorrow. No classes next week. No classes. So I will miss you. Let's see. Basic module two. Here we go. So we're going to share our screen. Let me share my screen and maybe. Hopefully we don't get disconnected today. Okay, there you go. Can you see my, let me see. Can you see my screen? Can you see it or no? Can you not see it? Can you see it? No, yet, teacher. Yeah. No. no, I'm not sure. It's loading. Now, yes. I know for a fact that this computer, it's giving me issues lately. <laughs> okay, so we're going to go over our final objectives. We already spoke about um, sports and seasons. Can you tell me the seasons of the year? Do you remember? What are the four seasons of the year? Spring, summer. I'm sorry? Spring. Spring, okay, what else? Fall. Fall, okay, what else? Summer. Summer, okay, and? Winter. Winter, that's right. All right. And um, let's see. What else? Sports? Well, sports is easy, right? What's your favorite sport, by the way? Or what sport do you watch? What sport do you play? Volunteers? I play soccer. You play soccer? Yeah. So, who do you play soccer with? Hi, good evening. Welcome. Who do you play soccer with, Osmin? I play soccer uh, in the weekends. Uh -uh. With who? With who do you me. play soccer with? Who, I who play soccer. is for person? Uh huh. I play soccer with my friend. Correct. You got it, sir. You got it. Uh huh. And you guys? How about you? Okay, no more. Vaya, apaguemos ahí el, el TV, please. Uh, Oh, nos vamos para el otro cuarto, please, because we're going to interfere with the class. So what sports do you play? What sports do you play? Uh -huh. Or what sports do you watch? 
place in Facebook. I'm sorry, can you repeat? Can you can you please repeat? Baseball. I'm sorry, can you repeat? Baseball. Baseball? That's incomplete. Baseball. Mm -hmm. I play baseball. I, I play baseball. baseball. Yes. I play baseball. Repeat. <laughs> Remember, you have to give a subject. Every time you give an idea, you start with the subject. Maybe it's I, maybe it's you, right? I play baseball, okay? One question for Candy. She plays baseball. One question for her, class. WH, WH question. Who do you play baseball with? Good job, Andy. I play baseball with my friends. One more question, WH question for Candy. Come on, come on, come on, come on. How oh often do you play baseball? Yes, only Andy, solo una estudiante tengo. Ah, no, dos con Candy, solo dos tengo, eh. Y rima, Andy, Candy. Okay, y los demás, ¿qué pasó, guys? What happened? Come on. How often? How do you, how do you like? It Vamos con ese primero. How often do you, how often do you play? I usually play baseball twice a year. <laughs> Wonderful, twice a year, okay. That's not very often, but it is what it is. What sports do you watch? Hey, what sports do you watch? Class, what sports do you watch? You don't watch sports. You I watch, watch novels, huh? Lookers. Uh, <laughs> si miran deporte o no? Solo chicos. <laughs> Okay. What, what what sports do you watch? I watch UFC. The UFC? Oh, me too. I love it. Okay. Para los que no saben es de las artes marciales, ¿verdad, Sandra? UFC. Sandra watches the UFC. Questions. WH questions. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Questions when for Sandra. Do you watch? When Repeat, do you watch? Osmin. When do you watch? When do you watch UFC? I, I watch. ¿Quién me tiene un audio ahí interfiriendo, please? I watch, I watch UFC. I watch it on Saturdays. Creo que las peleas son los sábados, so it's on Saturdays. Okay, Sandra. Or I watch, or watch Reputation. Or I watch the, 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 the reprise, the, the replay. Yeah, the replay. Yeah, the recording. Okay, guys, let's go ahead and move on. Thank you for coming. I'm going to uh, move on now with our objectives. We already uh, practiced WH questions. Okay, um, don't forget to use uh, do and does, okay? Today we're going to go with can and can't, okay? Let's go with the pronunciation. Hi everyone. In this class, you'll learn to sound natural when using can and can't. Let's start by listening to the pronunciation of can and can't. Can and can't. Notice the pronunciation of can and can't. Do you notice the difference? Can and can't. Affirmative and negative. Can and can't. Affirmative? Affirmative? And can. negative. Can. 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 Negative? Can. Can. Can't. I can act, but I can't sing very well. This is a very simple pronunciation. If you notice the positive statement, I can act. Above the word, you can see 
how that is pronounced. Can as the pronunciation symbol. On the other hand, the negative statement is pronounced differently. We will pronounce it as can't. Another tip that I would like to mention here is remember this letter T can't. You make it negative. Okay. For example, I can act. Also, your intonation. I can act, but I can't sing very well. Can you repeat? I can act. I can I act. I can act. Very well. But I can't sing very well. For example, me, I can play soccer, but I can't cook very well. Can you give one example? I'm all ears. Come on. Talk to me. Talk to me. What? Alguien tiene interferencia, chicos. I don't know who it is, but help me out, please. Yo no entiendo mucho porque se escucha otro audio cuando se habla. Sí, 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 sí. Come on, guys, help me. No puedo creerlo, chicos. Vamos a ver. Rosario. Vamos a estar con su micrófono apagado, ¿ok, Rosario? Ok. Good. So, el afirmativo, decíamos, Miss, decíamos que el afirmativo se pronuncia can. Yo can. puedo. Remember, this is about abilities. Can and can't is to describe abilities. Cosas que usted sabe hacer muy bien o cosas que no sabe hacer muy bien. So, can, I can act. Yo puedo. Affirmative. I can act. But I can't I, sing very well. Go ahead. Ed. I can market. I, I can, can market it. can marketing. But I Mar can. Marketing? Marketing. No, 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 no. Go back to the example. Aquí. I can. Y qué dice después? I can act. I can act. Oh, ¿Qué es act? What is act? Actuar. Okay. Actuar. Grammatically. Grammaticalmente. ¿Qué es act? It what? Like dramatizar. It's an action. It's a verb. Entonces, ¿qué quiere decir eso? Que después de can, tú necesitas un verbo, Edson. Class, ah, okay. you need a verb. Igual acá en el negativo. I can't sing. Repeat, sing. I, what is sing? Cantar. Oh, okay, grammatically. Grammatically, it's a verb, Candy. It's a verb. So, Next to can, a verb. Next to can't, a verb. Y el verbo, guys, no va a cambiar. Eso es mágico. Por eso es súper fácil. Porque nunca va a cambiar. Afirmativo, negativo, cualquier subject, siempre va a ir igual. ¿Ok? Give one example. Uh, yo les decía, I can play soccer very well. Yeah, I can play soccer, but I can't cook very well. Ingrid, go ahead. I can, I can drink to travel to France, but I can because I don't have visa. Maybe you will in the future. Thank you. Maybe. Somebody else? Me, I can swim very well, and but I can't uh, dance very well. Dance, sorry, dance. Dance, yes, se autocorrige Candy, miren cómo me ahorra. Okay, wonderful. ¿Quién más? ¿Quién más? ¿Quién más? Who else? Who else? I, I can cook, but I can't play football very well. ¿Cuál es la corrección ahí, chicos? What's the correction? I can cook. I can cook. Okay. I can cook, but I can cook, but I can't play football very well. Very well. Nice, 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 nice. Thank you. Let's continue. When it comes to negative statements, which are contracted, we can also follow the simple rule. If there's a contraction which ends in NT, you can think of extending that N. Let me illustrate that. 
I can't sing very well. This trick can also help with pronunciation. English pronunciation is not an easy topic and it requires a lot of listening and practicing. I would like to encourage you to practice these two simple phrases. Practice by listening and repeating. Do this several times until you feel like it's not difficult for you. Do you have any questions about can and can't? No. Can I hear more examples? Can I hear more examples? Tell me about something you can do and something you can't do. Can I hear some examples? For example, I can drive a car, but I can't sing very well. I can drive, but I can drive. Excellent. I can eat pizza. Uh -huh. I can eat pizza, but I can uh, seafood. And the verb? Again, you need a verb. I can, but I can see food. Eat. Eat. But I can eat seafood. Remember, seafood. Edson, you need a verb. You need an action verb to connect the activity. Seafood is the activity or the complement. So eat is the verb to associate that, okay? You need verbs. Give me an example. Give me an example. Let me see. Give me an example. Uh-huh. Uh huh. Teacher, I can um, bailar. Como, what do you say? Uh huh. That's a basic verb. Dance. I can dance, uh, but I cannot clean. Clean? Okay. Really? All right. Anyone else? Anyone else? Interesting. Active participation. Talk to me. Talk to me, William. I can't ride a bike, but I can't swimming ball. I can ride a bike, but I can't. But I can't swim. Swim, swim, But I can't go. But I can't swimming. So go swimming. Puede decir, I can't go swimming, or I can't swim. Okay. Thank you. Somebody else? No more. Okay. Let's okay. move on. Let's move on, guys. We have more information here to study. Can for ability. Remember, can is for ability. For example, play the guitar. Repeat, play the guitar. Play the guitar. Play the guitar, play the guitar, play the guitar. is a talent, is, is an ability. So you use can. I can play the guitar. A little. Wow. A little bit. Wow. I can play the guitar a little bit. But... <laughs> I can't play the piano. You understand? Okay. Yes. Let's watch this video. Let's watch this video. Check it out. Okay, okay. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn to ask and answer questions using can for ability. Let's get started by listening to a conversation titled, I can't sing very well. This conversation illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. I can't sing. Oh, look, there's a talent contest on Saturday. Let's enter. I can't enter a talent contest. What can I do? You can sing really well. Oh, thanks. Well, you can too. Oh, no, 
I can't sing at all, but I can play the piano. So maybe we can enter the contest. Sure. Why not? Okay. Let's practice tomorrow. Now let's analyze the examples on this. Well, you Check can this conversation too. out. Oh no. Check this conversation out. Can you can you visualize the conversation? Or do you want me to send a picture on the WhatsApp? Send the picture. Let me send the picture for you. Oops, not a selfie, right? Not a selfie. I was taking here a picture. <laughs> All right. Okay, I think you can see it now. On the WhatsApp chat. Okay. So listen and listen and repeat. Oh, look, there's a talent contest on Saturday. Oh, look. Oh, look. There is a talent contest on Saturday. Let's enter. Let's enter. Let's. It's for invitation, right? Let's enter. Let's enter. Let's enter. Repeat. I can't enter a talent contest. I can't enter a talent contest. What can I do? What can I do? What can I do? What can I do? What, what can I? What can I do? 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 Okay. You can sing it very well. Well, you, you can, can sing, sing really well. Really well. Really well. You can sing it really well. You can sing really well. Really well. Really well is excellent. Repeat really well. Really well. Really well. Equals excellent. Okay. You can sing excellent. You can sing really well. Repeat. Oh, thanks. Oh, thanks. Oh, thanks. Well, oh, thanks. You well, can well, too. Well, you can well, too. too. You can too. You can too. You, you can, too. Too. You can too. too. Oh no, I can't sing at all. Oh no. Oh no, I can't sing at at all. At all. At all. At all. At all. At all. Underline at all. Pongan una parte ahí. Cuando es negativa, pueden usarlo. Cuando es negative. At all. Es como, yo no puedo cantar como que. Para nada. Correct. I can't sing at all. Um, I can't sing at all. ¿Qué es la diferencia si yo digo, I can't sing at all versus I can't, I can't sing a little. Correct, correct. Repeat. Correct, repeat. But I can play the piano. But I can. But I, but I. But I. But I. But I can play the piano. 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 But I. But I can play the piano. But I can play the piano. So maybe we can enter the contest. Oh, maybe, maybe we can enter the contest. Contest? You know what is contest? Contest. It's it's a competition, contest. okay? Contest. It's a competition, okay? A contest. Contest. And Kyla says, sure, why not? Repeat, sure. Sure, sure. why not? Sure. Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? How do you interpret why not? Por qué no? Correct, correct. Okay, como quien dijo miedo, verdad? Who says fear right there? Why not? Philip says, okay, let's practice tomorrow. Okay. okay let's practice tomorrow. But I can very well. Okay, let's check it out. He can sing very well. Look, affirmative. 
I, you, he, she, it, all the subject pronouns is the same. Can sing very well, affirmative. Can sing very well. Very well is for affirmatives, most commonly for affirmatives. And at all is for negatives, okay? For example, she can't sing at all. Ella, para nada, ¿verdad? Questions. Ponemos el can al principio. Can you sing? Can you sing? Can I, can I sing? Guys, can I sing? What do you think? Can I sing? Can I sing? Can I sing? Can I sing? Yes, you can. Or no, you yes. can't. For example, for example, can you speak Spanish? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Repeat, yes, I can. Yes, I can. Little, little. A little. Okay. Can the person, listen, the person, can, can Andy Colato speak Spanish? Yes. Yes, she can. Yes, she can. All right. Can Osmin Herrera dance? Yes, he can. <laughs> yes, he can. Only cumbias, yes, but... Can. Yes, he can. No, I'm just kidding. Just... Yes, yeah, he can. <laughs> can you make a question? Can you make a question? Can you... Osmin, can you dance? Ooh, Osmin, can you dance, Osmin? Can you dance? No, I, I can't. I no, can't. All right, yeah. You can't, no problem. ¿Qué más can podrías decir ahí? Can you cook? Oh, can you cook? Mm, no, I can't cook very well. You can't cook very well, okay. Only, only Maruchan soup, right? <laughs> very yeah, well. Only can you make Marushan. a question? Make a question, class. Make a question. Can, can you drive? You, can you drive a car? Repeat. Can, can you, you drive a car? Can you drive a car? 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 Uh-huh, yeah. guys. Can you drive a car? Can you drive? Yes, I can. 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 sleep in the car. Oh, but you can sleep in the car. Oh, my goodness. That's a big ability. Some people can't sleep, right? Very yes. well. Could you make a third person question? Third person. Can't you draw? Can she draw? Can she draw? Yeah, can she can draw she pictures? Yes. Can, can William play the piano? Can William play the piano? No, I can't. So, class, can William play the piano? No, William play the piano? No, he can't. Yes? No, he can't. Okay. Make a third person question. Come on, third person. No, he can't. Can, he can't. can Nancy... Nancy? I'm sorry, can you repeat? Uh, can Nancy dance? Can, can Nancy dance? Oh my God, don't get nervous. Don't get nervous. Relax. <laughs> Can, can, can Nancy, yeah, Nancy dance? Yeah. Acuérdense que el verbo va en su forma base, tal cual. No agregamos tú, no agregamos ese, no agregamos nada más. Can Nancy dance? Yeah. What, which, who's Nancy? Which Nancy? Let me see Nancy, Nancy, Nancy. Where's Nancy? Hi. Nancy Hernandez. <gasps> That's a good question. Uh, Excuse me, Nancy. Can you dance? Yes, I, I can't. Bueno, hasta ahí te puedes quedar, que puedes decir, yes, I can. Okay. Yes, okay. I can. Puedes alargar, así como está en la afirmativa acá, puedes decir, yes, I can dance very well. Ahora, si yes, tú dices, I can, I can dance. dance very well, es que lo haces súper bien. <laughs> So, can you dance? 
No, I can't. You can't? <laughs> Only the eyes. Only the eyes. Yeah. Only your eyes. Make one more question. Go ahead. Third person. Can you buy a taxi? Ooh, I love it. Eso me gusta que choquen las 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 voces ahí. Okay, guys. Can she drive a taxi? Can she drive? Can she drive a taxi? Hey, can, can um can, can children play soccer? Can children play soccer? Excellent. Guys, can, can children play soccer? Play yes, they can. They are can. Yes, yes, they can. can. Okay, vámonos acá. Podemos usar con WH. What can I do? ¿Qué puedo hacer yo? What can I do? What can I do? Si alguien le pregunta, what can I do? Decimos una habilidad que usted ha observado, right? What can I do? Ah, you can sing. You can dance. You can sing. You can play video games. You can sleep in the car. Hmm? For example, I can play a guitar. I can you program can a computer. Ah, yeah. Podemos hacer who questions? Como, ¿quién hace esto? ¿Quién puede hacer esto? For example, who can sing? Okay. Vamos a decir el nombre. Vamos a decir Philip. Philip can. For example, Where? in this class, who can dance? Who can dance in this class? Who can who can uh -huh. dance? Every, everybody. <laughs> everybody can. Repeat. Everybody, everybody can. can. Everybody can. Okay. <clears throat> who can who can sing very well in this class? Who can sing? I can. I, can. I don't. I can. <laughs> Si sabemos de alguien, decimos, Rosario can. María can. Who can, who can make tortillas in this class? I, I can. Ah, liars. Can you, Andy? I can eat. <laughs> Nancy, can you make? Okay, Ingrid, go ahead, Ingrid. Where can I go to in vacation? On vacation. Oh, where can I go? Where can I go on vacation? Yes. What can I do? Yes. Excellent job. Let's continue. She can't sing at all. Just do it. We can't <laughs> sing at all. They can't sing at all. Can you sing? Yes, I can. No, I can't. Can I sing? Yes, you can. No, you can't. Can he sing? Yes, he can. No, he can't. Can she sing? Yes, she can. No, she can't. Can we sing? Yes, we can. No, we can't. Can they sing? Yes, they can. No, they can't. What can I do? You can sing. Who can sing? Philip can. I would like to explain the usage of can. We can use can to express some kind of ability, whether that is related to sports, professional, something artistic, or something special. Singing is something that only a few people can do, and most people can't. In my case, I can't sing at all. Let me get started by explaining how to form statements with can. To do this, we can follow this formula. Subject plus can or can't plus the verb plus complement. Now let's analyze a couple of examples. I can sing very well. Uh, the subject is I. Then we're going to add can. After that we have the verb sing. Uh, finally, what is next? 
after can or can't, you need a? Verb. Verb. Verbs. Remember, Edson? Remember, class? Verb. 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 And then you need the complement. Okay? Verb. Verb. We Last have a complement. Let's analyze one more example. She can't sing at all. Negative. The subject is she. Then we're going to add can't. After that, we have the verb sing. Finally, we can include a complement at all. Now let's learn how to form questions using can. To do this, we can follow this formula. The auxiliary can this is for questions. plus subject plus the verb plus a complement. Let's analyze a couple of examples to make sure we understand this topic. Can you sing? First, we need to add the auxiliary can. After that, we include the subject. And next, we have guys sing and a question mark. Finally, we can include a complement. In these examples, there is no complement, but we could add something like at home. These are yes or no questions. So the way to answer this type of questions is quite simple. For the question, can you sing? We can answer positively by saying, yes, I can. And we can answer negatively by saying, no, I can't. Okay, estas eran yes, no questions, ¿verdad? Si ustedes observan y escuchan bien que la pregunta comienza con can, solo es de contestar yes or no, siempre y cuando usemos el can. For example, can you uh, make pupusas? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Make, I can. make pupusas. No, I can. No, I can. can. <laughs> ah, yes, I can. No, yes, I can't. I can. can you play a musical instrument? No, I can't. 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 Y ahora, si la pregunta comienza con WH word, ahí sí es diferente, right? Like, what can you do? So, yo les digo, what can you do? Aha, uh -huh, guys, what can you do? What can you do? Uh... I, I can, can play a guitar. Yes! I can drive a car. Excellent. I can Excellent. Can... And, 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 and um, what can't you do? Computer. I'm sorry? David? I can, pro I, I can program a computer. Oh, that's affirmative. That's affirmative. I can program. Repeat. Program. I can program a computer. Okay. Now, my question is negative. What can't you do? What can't you do? I, I can make pupusas and tortillas. <laughs> you can only eat them. Okay. I can't speak French. I can't. I can't speak French. Can you speak French? No, I can't. Speak. I can't. You really French. like eating, huh? Do you? You really like no, eating, huh? I can't. Okay, check it out. Let's analyze one last example. Can he sing? First, we need the auxiliary verb can. After that, we include the subject he. Next, we have the verb sing. And a question mark at the end. We can answer positively by saying, yes, yes, he can. The person, he can. And we can answer negatively by saying, no, he can't. Now it's your turn to practice using can and can't. Guys, I would like for ya hicimos ejemplos, así que traten de practicar in your house. Practice affirmatives. Hagan affirmative examples, affirmatives, negative examples, many, 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 and questions. You have to dominate affirmative, negative, and questions using can. Okay? okay. 
Please remember that practice makes perfect. So the more you practice, the better for you. You increase your English level. So let me see, this is moving a little bit slow. Let me try again. Okay, this is your knowledge check. And this is uh, one of the last objectives. Remember, we're talking about abilities and talents, right? Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn vocabulary for discussing different abilities and talents. Let's get started by listening to some common abilities and talents. Word power. Musical or artistic. Paint pictures. Play the violin. Sing English songs. Technical or mechanical. Design a web page. Fix a car. Fix a motorcycle. Athletic. Do gymnastics. Ride a horse. Surf. Other. Bake a cake. Play chess. Tell good jokes. Now I would like for you to do a couple of things. First, categorize these activities using the categories musical or artistic, athletic, other, technical or mechanical. Uh, just like you see on the example, other, bake a cake. Then I would like for you to use the vocabulary and relate it to yourself, a family member, or a friend. For example, I can fix a car, but I can't fix a motorcycle. After you finish this activity, share your work in our discussion forums. Okay, here we have some vocabulary. It's very difficult to visualize, okay? It's very difficult. So first we have bake a cake. Bake a cake. Repeat, bake a cake. I'm going to try to chat it. Bake a cake. Bake a cake. Bake a cake. Bake a cake. What is bake? What is bake? Ornear. Okay, repeat. Design a web page. Design. Design. The verb is design. Do gymnastics. Do gymnastics. Do gymnastics. 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 Um, fix a car. Fix a car. Fix a car. Fix a motorcycle. Saben que se puede decir fix o pueden decir repair. Ok, para que incrementemos ahí vocabulary. Fix a motorcycle o repair a motorcycle. Fix a motorcycle or repair a motorcycle. Ahí sí no sé qué dice, guys. I'm sorry, no alcanzo a leer. Paint pictures. Oh, thank you so much. Paint pictures. Paint. Paint pictures. Pictures. Paint Pero esto sí ya es más como professional, ¿verdad? Paint pictures. Okay. Play. What? Chess. Play Paint chess. Things. Thank you. Play chess. Do you know what is chess? Ajedrez. Ajedrez. Okay. Play the violin. Repeat, play the violin. Play the violin. Play the violin. Ride a horse. Ride. Ride. Acuérdense que es diferente. Ride. Que ride. ¿Verdad? Ride. Yes. Ok, ok, ok. Ride a horse. Sing English song. Ooh, my favorite. Sing English songs. Sing English songs. Sing English songs. Surf. 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 Or tell good jokes. Tell good jokes. Do you know what is tell good jokes? 
Tell me. Ya. ¿Qué es bueno, sí. la broma? Decir, contar, ¿verdad? Decir o contar. Contar yeah. sería acá. Tell good jokes. Ok, Very so. Good jokes. What of this, uh, which of these activities can you do and which of mm -hmm. these activities can't you do? For example, I can I sing can English songs. Sing English song. <laughs> you owe me a soda. Me debes una soda, Andy. No, I say I can't. <laughs> oh, you can't? You can't? Mm -hmm. Oh, no, I can't. okay. You can't sing English songs. Oh, okay. I can't. I can't sing English songs. The despacita means de las de las románticas, right? The easy ones. Uh huh. Tell me something negative or something positive. I want to hear you. I can sing I can English songs in my mind. Sing English songs, Adele. Okay, Francisco, that's affirmative, correct? Yes. But Wonderful. In my mind. I understand, but I understand. That's the important. Candy, can you repeat? Um, I can sing. Sing, I can sing song of Adele. Adele? Yes. Demonstration. Demonstration. <laughs> ah. <laughs> yes? Yes, I can. Okay, good. Good. Can you can you make a question? Can somebody make a question using these activities? For example, excuse me, uh, Maria, can you play the violin? No, I, can, uh, I can't okay. play the violin. Okay. Can you make a question, guys? Go. Nancy, can you tell good job? Yeah. Uh, no, I can't. Okay, no problem, no problem. Thank you, good job. Next, next, next. Francisco, can you play the sing a song? Oh no, excuse me. Uh, Francisco, can you sing a song? Uh, no, I can't, but I can I can sing a song in my mind. In my mind, only you, only for you. Yes. In private, privacy, huh? <laughs> okay. Question, mm -hmm. question, say excuse me. Use excuse me. Excuse me. Who, who can fix a computer? Guys, who can fix a computer? I can. I can't. You can't? No, I can fix me, a computer. I can't. <laughs> ah, can. David can. Yeah. David can. Yeah. Así vamos a decir, David can. David can. David can. Correct, correct. All right, let's move on. And I think this is the very last objective. Let me check. It's a little reading, yeah. It's a little reading. Vamos a ver si pueden ver este. Yo creo que se ve mejor. Let me check. Let me check. Mm -hmm. Bueno, lo voy a tomar así porque no se ve muy bien. Ok. So. Ok, class. Let's go do some reading. I posted the pictures on the WhatsApp chat already in case you can see it a little better over there. So let's check. <coughs> Hi everyone. In this class, you'll read an article about four unique American races. You'll also develop skills in reading for specific information. Race the U.S. Climb the stairs of New York City's Empire State Building in the Empire State Building run-up. The climb is 1,050 feet, 320 meters, 86 floors, or 1,575 steps. Winners can reach the top in just 10 to 11 minutes. Can you? Take 8 or 10 days to race across America from Irvine, California to Savannah, Georgia. 
Across the entire U.S. in this 2,900-mile, 4,667-kilometer bicycle race. In this race, there are no timeouts for sleep. For 8 to 10 days, racers can sleep only about 3 hours each day. Race on the exciting white waters of the Arkansas River in the Downriver Race. Winners complete the 25.7 miles, 41.5 kilometers, in just two hours. This is the longest downriver race in the U.S. One person, one boat, take the challenge. Only possible in Alaska, the Iditarod Sled Dog Race. Race from downtown Anchorage to Nome, over 1,150 miles, 1,850 kilometers, through cold, wind, and snow. Winners usually finish the course in 9 to 12 days and receive cash prizes. Already, already, so... Let me go back on this video Days a little bit. Race across. Okay. And um, let's see. Race. Do you know what is a race? Race. Do you know what is a race? R A C. It's a competition. Correct. It's una carrera. Right? Race. The U.S. These are very uh, popular and famous competitions in the U.S. For example, this one uh, where you have to climb the stairs of the New York City's Empire State Building. Wow. Yeah. Um, the climb is what? 1,000? Repeat. 1,000? 50? 1,050 feet. 1,050 feet. 1,050 feet. 1,050 feet. 1,050 feet. 1,050 feet. Repeat, 86 floors. 86 floors. 86 floors. Or 1,000. 575 steps. Uh huh. Get on 1,050 feet. What is that? 1,050 feet? Yes. 50 pies. Uh huh. What is 86 floors? 86 pieces. Correct. Uh, and what is 1,575 steps? Pueden ser pasos, pero en este caso, como es un edificio, puede ser gradas, okay, escalones. Okay. And next one, let me see. Race across the America from Arvin, California. Oh my God, across the entire, across the entire U.S. Imagínense, guys, cruzar todo el Estados, Estados Unidos, cross the entire U.S. in this 2,900-mile bicycle race. Repeat, 2,900 miles. 100 miles. Bicycle race. Can you ride a bicycle, guys? Yeah. Yes, yes, I can. I can. No, I can. No, yes, I can. Yes, I can. Do you like riding a bicycle? Yes, I like. Yes, I do. No. I like. Yes, I really like. Are you are you good riding a bicycle? No. Really, love it. <laughs> Lo estoy desafiando. Ok. Vamos a ver ahí. In this race. Ok, vamos acá. Race. Let me see. Race on the exciting white waters. Las white waters. Do you know what is the white waters? Under Kansas? White waters? Maybe snow. With very cold, right? Because it's really, really under... Um, Zero degrees, maybe, huh? Let me see. Winners complete the 25.7. Repeat, 25.7 miles. 
25.7 You can say 41.5 kilometers. 41.5 kilometers. Okay. Okay, that is in a in a boat. One person, one boat, like this one, the picture. One person, one boat. That's kind of a difficult um, race, I think. Right? And to finish with, we have the race from downtown. Let me see. This is what? Through, the, through coal, wind, and snow. Imagine, guys. You have to go through, you have to go through cold, which is the weather is really cold. The wind, do you know what is the wind? El viento. El viento and viento. snow. Nieve. 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 Yes. So very, very, um, I would say cold. challenging competitions. From Irvine, California to Savannah, Georgia. Across the okay. entire U.S. in this two. All right. Very well. Very well. So I think this is it. From here, you have to complete your progress check, your knowledge check, actually. Okay. Creo que les han dado como una fecha, ¿verdad? Creo que ahora lo tienen que completar. ¿Es así? Oh, no. no, no, no. Bueno, entonces sí, tenemos que. Um, yo les sugiero que you complete it like as soon as possible. Pues a mí me yes, parece que ustedes en la years. plataforma que, hay, que faltan dos semanas con esta. El 27 dice que es una vez. Están seguros. You sure you're positive? Yes. Bueno, yo también he tratado de confirmar, pero bueno, mi jefe no me ha respondido. Así que we'll see. Le voy a consultar nuevamente por si acaso. Yo hoy le reporté a Flor Ajá. que yo había terminado las cinco secciones y el examen final, pero que me aparece ahí que la cuatro y la cinco no está desarrollada, pero sí me aparece el examen final de la cinco. Y me dijo a mí que... me apareció así, disculpe, a mí me apareció así con la tres, pero era porque había un video que no lo había terminado de ver. Y cuando lo terminé de ver, porque solo faltaban como unos segundos y solo por eso fue que no se había completado. Y cuando lo terminé de ver, ahí ya me marcó que ya estaba terminada la sección 3. Mm, bueno, voy a intentar eso entonces con bueno, estas otras. Porque hay una... una... A, mí, a mí estas preguntas, yo, yo creo que ya las contesté esta, eh, teacher. Ajá. Pero... O sea, como que me salieron antes, pero yo no, no he visto estas presentaciones, estas últimas. Pero yo voy a seguir el orden hasta terminar las secciones 5, pero sí, esta creo que ya, ya las estuve completando. Ok, ok. Bueno, este... Qué lástima que no podemos verificar bien ese dato. Porque, um, bueno, sí, en mi correo sí me sale también, pero, guys, en, entiendo que con ustedes son 16 clases. So, according to my records, esta es la clase número 16. So, I'm not sure. No sé si despedirme, no sé si decirles, este, nos vemos la otra semana, so I'm not sure. I'm not really sure. Pero si es así, 
Se supone que entonces ya debemos de terminar la sección 5 con el examen final. Sí, de hecho ahorita estamos terminándolo, terminando la unidad 5. Section 5, it's done. Entonces, este, bueno, lo que les puedo Según decir es yo, que se queda una pendiente. semana para la, completar la semana 5. Sí, igual todos me están diciendo igual. Ajá, igual a mí me cayó el correo, pero no sé si soy yo. Pero en todo caso, si es así, chicos, si fuera así, para mí mejor, porque podríamos hacer como un uh, sí, review de todo. Ajá, dime. Sí. Acá reviso una plataforma en mi cell phone y no sé si alcanza a ver ahí, pero aquí este dice que el 27 de junio es la finalización. Sí, sí, finalización sí. sí. Del curso. Yes, yes, sir. En eso estamos. Entonces, eh, mejor, como les digo, ¿verdad? Mejor, si es así, we can, we can review more. Podemos incluso ir repasando los puntos más importantes y podemos tener como un full review la otra semana. Así que es como que lleváramos una semana de ventaja, eh, si fuera ese caso, ¿verdad? Lo que les puedo decir es que sigan pendientes del WhatsApp. ¿Ok? People, you have any question? You have any question before we go? ¿Qué mandaron? Oh, thank you. Vamos a ver si tenemos dos minutos. Vamos a escuchar a... Vamos a ver a quién escuchamos. A María. María Dolores. Cuéntanos, María, ¿cómo se ha sentido? ¿Qué le pasó, Nancy? ¿Está bien? Ya le vamos a dar un minuto, ¿ok? María, díganos sus impresiones. Hola, buenas noches a todos. Pues, en Hola. español, porque en speaking aún no. <ríe> Vamos. English. Bueno, este, le diré de manera personal, retada en el sentido del de inglés. Para mí ha sido una experiencia que me ha sacado el jugo. Entre horario de trabajo, ya que trabajo de noche... Eh, ir trabajando la plataforma, aprender de los que ya conocen un poquito más, eh, escuchar, a veces tal vez no participo porque estoy en el trabajo, pero ahí ando escuchando y pues saber de que, de que este de verdad a todos nos, el idioma inglés es importante ahora en nuestro tiempo y entender de que si no lo conocemos o no estamos actualizados, también vamos perdiendo oportunidades. Y, y es una manera para poder, este, en el caso mío, tengo hijos y a veces mi hijo que tiene 11 años, quinto grado, y a veces él me está aquí soplando, ¿verdad? Porque van un poquito más adelantados. Y por eso es que yo les, pues les comento de que ahí me pone en, en un conflicto porque me, me motiva a, a, a continuar porque ya el inglés es una necesidad, no es un nada más conocerlo por, porque ya sé inglés y voy a andar alucinando, sino que es una necesidad ahora en este tiempo. Gracias. Excelente, Miss. Me parece mucho lo que nos ha compartido. Y pues, sinceramente, yo espero que sigamos adelante. Independientemente si nos queda una semana o no, sigan adelante, guys. Me tienen muy, muy uh, happy, like excited, like amazed, porque todos son muy participativos. Bueno, eh, quizás no habían trabajado con un uh, facilitador así que les les haga pues hablar a todos un poquito, ¿verdad? Eh, en la medida del caso y pues sigan adelante, ¿ok? Eh, hopefully I see you later. Hopefully I'll see you later. Happy weekend, everyone, ¿ok? Okay. Hey, happy Father's Day tomorrow. Happy holiday. Tomorrow is Father's happy Day. Happy Father's Day. Happy celebration. Happy Father's Day. Happy celebration. Congratulations. All right. Goodbye, everyone. Good Goodbye. night. Goodbye. Bye. 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 Bye